Hello children. Hope all of you are fine and staying safe at home. Today, ma'am has come to teach you a new topic. You want to know which topic are we going to learn today? We are going to learn about the concept of after numbers. Yes children, today we will learn about the concept of after numbers. But before we start the new topic, let us do counting from 1 to 10. So let's start. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Very good children. You all did very well. So now let's start our new topic. That is after numbers. You know children, what is meant by after numbers? After number means the number that comes next. Yes children, after number means the number that comes next. Let us learn about after numbers with the help of an example. Children, can you see the boat? See, who is this? This is Rhea. This is Rhea. And he is Rhea's brother. He is Rhea's brother. And you know, Rhea wants to go near her brother. Rhea wants to go near her brother. Now, what she has to do? She has to move a step forward. She has to move a step forward to go near her brother. Now, can you see children? Rhea is standing at which number? She is standing at number 1. She is standing at number 1. Now, she will move a step forward. Now, children, look at the number at which she is standing. She is standing at number 2. Now, she is standing at number 2. Previously, she was at number 1 and now she is at number 2. So, what does this mean, children? This means that the number that comes after 1 is 2. The number that comes after 1 is 2. Now, see, is Rhea closer to her brother? Not yet. Again, she has to move a step forward. Now, Rhea has stepped up. Rhea has stepped forward. Now, previously she was at number 2. And now she is at number 3. So, what does this mean, children? That the number that comes after 2 is 3. So, the number that comes after 2 is 3. Now, again Rhea has to move a step forward to go near her brother. See, now Rhea has again stepped forward. Previously, she was at number 3. And now she is at number 4. So, what does this mean? That the number that comes after 3 is 4. The number that comes after 3 is 4. Now, again she has to move a step forward to go near her brother. Now, Rhea is at number 5. Now, Rhea is at number 5. Previously, she was at number 4. 
and now she is at number 5. So what does this mean children? That the number that comes after 4 is 5. The number that comes after 4 is 5. And you can also see children that Rhea has come closer to her brother. Rhea has come closer to her brother. Now children, let us revise what we have learned. See, Rhea was at number 1 previously. Initially, Rhea was standing at number 1. Then, she moved a step forward and she reached number 2. So that means, the number that comes after 1 is 2. The number that comes after 1 is 2. Now she will again move a step forward. She was at number 2 previously and now she is at number 3. So this means that the number that comes after 2 is 3. The number that comes after 2 is 3. Now she has again stepped, uh, stepped forward. So previously she was at number 3 and now she is at number 4. So this means that the number that comes after 3 is 4. The number that comes after 3 is 4. Now again she will move a step forward. Now she is at number 5. Previously she was at number 4 and now she is at number 5. So the number that comes after 4 is 5. The number that comes after 4 is 5. And now children... You can also see that she has come near her brother, isn't it? Now children, let us do an exercise on after numbers. You already know children that we write the numbers under the different headings of tens and ones. Now let me write tens and once for you on the board. This is T. T means tens. And this is O. O means once. Now let me write it again for you. T means tens and O means once. Now children, you already know that single digit numbers are written under the ones house. So now let me write one for you and let's find out which number comes after one. Children, you can see there is a number line now let's find out which number comes after 1. You can see the number 1 written over here. Okay. Now if we move a step forward, which number did we reach? We reached the number 2. We reached the number 2. So that means... The number that comes after 1 is 2. The number that comes after 1 is 2. So, now let us write the number 2 in the blank. See, the number that comes after 1 is 2. Now, let me find
find let us find the number that comes after 2 now let us find from the number line that which number comes after 2 now see th this is the number 2 and now if we move a step forward which number did we reach we reached the number 3 we reached the number 3 so that means the number that comes after 2 is 3 the number that comes after 2 is 3 now let us write the number 3 in the blank see children the number that comes after 2 is 3 so children i hope that now you have understood the concept of after numbers do revise the concept of after numbers at your home till then goodbye children